After starting the PWA2000 and waiting while it boots automatically, you can already insert a prepared USB stick with a cable project. It is also possible to track a project from a network to the PWA2000, provided there is an internet connection. After booting up and dragging the project from the USB stick to the PWA2000, open the PWA control. This is the software that runs on each of our PWA machines. In PWA control, we can select and import a project by clicking on Import. When we do this, we have the option to set a repetition factor. If we run redo this, then the possibilities of grouping and sorting open up to us. Grouping means that with a repetition factor of three, each cable is manufactured three times directly one after the other. This is a good option when building control cabinets in parallel. Sorting means that with a repetition factor of three, the entire project is manufactured three times in a row. After the project is imported, we open it. Here we can see all the information that are available in the cable list. The print texts, color, cross section and finishing types are displayed for each cable. If we now click on start, the PWA tells us which cable of which color and cross section must be inserted. After this has been done, we acknowledge the message, the machine starts production and the printer prints the label. Since the stripper crimper can only apply for rules, we have to apply the ring cable lux by hand. With the label attached, the cable now looks like this. The cable can now be easily stapled into the holder provided on the workstation. By clicking start again, the PWA2000 tells us which cable we have to insert and produce it. With a wire end for rule, we can simply use the stripper crimper. This is what the result looks like. The cable holder on the workstation can be easily removed and attached to the SWT3000 for further processing. A total of four cable holders are possible there. The SWT3000 is a portable system to use cables and cable lists directly at the workstation and to lock the work. It uses the same software as the PWA2000 and therefore the operation is identical. After opening the project, you can see all the information available on the cable and check if everything is correct. After clicking start, the software jumps to the next cable and the previous cable is marked as processed. If you have made the project with a repetition factor, the SWT3000 is also a good way to keep order over the projects. If a print is unreadable or missing, you can also print a new label directly from the SWT3000.